Keith, uh, I love you, man. Uh, you know how I am, guys. I didn't uh, hear much about this actually until uh, 20 minutes ago. I saw uh, some videos on it. Um, then I checked out Law Tide's uh, video today. Man, it's always the good people. When I think of a BBD Keith. Man, I came across this guy 2009. And I'll try to look at you in the camera as much as I can, but uh we hit it off immediately. There's only a few people here on YouTube who have, who have overlooked uh Overlooked my uh, the way that I am, and as still I've still stuck by me all these years. I remember Keith BBD uh, go watch my previous videos. We met in 2009 at the Falcons game uh, and the Cardinals 2009 10. Not quite sure. Remember what year? Uh, but we hit it off immediately. And, you know, Keith, a lot of you guys who know Keith, uh, always knew him to be, he would be very funny a lot of the times. He would take pot shots at me all the time. But he uh, always appreciated me. We sent a lot of private messages, phone calls, uh, All these years, we finally met in 2010. We went to the Slop Olympics a couple years ago here in Atlanta. And we were texting a lot because I remember when I went and, and hung out with him early this, early this year. I don't remember if it was late last year or early this year. But those of you who saw my video, that went up to Greenville and hung out with BBD. You know, Keith, we went to a Greenville Devils game on that Friday. He got me the shirt. <laughs> Go check out the uh, the video that was done. I forgot it was on my channel or his, probably mine, when I walked through the door. And just like Keith always says, he always has something smart to say, but we had so, we've had so much fun. Uh, the, the news of what's going on right now with Keith, uh, my friend, and many others, just breaks my heart. You know, he always joked with me a lot. He'd be like, damn, David, I don't know if I'll even be here much longer. We sat and talked I, when I was up there. And he uh, he told me that, and I just told, I told him to stop. But he was understanding of the fact that his health was not good. I, I really don't know what to say, really, guys. I just wanted to show my love and appreciation for my friend, Keith. He gave me this when I was up there. He gave me this when I was up there. Um, if there's one person on YouTube that I thought would be here forever, it would be him. I, I've never seen somebody go through so much pain and health, but yet stay so upbeat. Always happens to the good ones. Now, that last report that I heard that Keith has brain damage, I saw in Law Tide's video that they called the family in. That's clearly not good. So, this is not technically goodbye. But it kind of feels that way. Oh my gosh. I 
I invited him to come down for my birthday. He really wanted to make it, but he had no way to get down here. And I told him if he could somehow make it down, he'd have a place to stay. And he apologized for not being able to make it, but he said, happy birthday, brother. And uh, I wish I could have made it. You know, to know Keith BBD, for those who just knew him on YouTube, you knew the kind of person that he was and how funny he was. <laughs> the guy, this guy was hilarious. To give an example of some of the things that he would say about me, like he wrote on this hat here that he gave me, he said to Slitter, my favorite annoying big mouth dipshit BVD <laughs> Keith I will love you until my time is called I had a lot of fun battling and I wouldn't even call it battling with you I wouldn't even call it battling my friend I wouldn't call we had so much fun uh Thoughts and prayers to his family, his friends. I roomated with him up there. I forgot his name, but I met him and another friend. Obviously, to his, his daughter, Kayla. Never got a chance to meet her. I think I talked to her on the phone briefly when I was up there. Always happens to the good people. Always happens to the good people. I just wish I could. I wish, wish I could talk to him on the phone one more time, and tell him how much I love him. He would always joke with me a lot, but in private, he would say the same thing. Man, he sent me. You know, when it comes to my mom's health, you know, she's getting up there. She's seventy-six. She's had some health issues. Keith reached out to me and tell me to just to be there for my mom, and he's thinking about my mom, and I appreciate that. I love you Keith you know that you've always known that and I appreciate you one of the few sticking with me and sticking with the type of person that I am my personality my goofiness my annoyingness but you always took time to be there for me and I appreciate it very much and I'm sorry that uh all these things have happened to you. You've definitely, in my opinion, deserved better. Considering all the bullshit that happens on YouTube, the way that some people have treated you throughout the years on here, you deserve better. I've told you that. And I've always been very appreciative of your friendship. So I love you, Keith. And um, I... I love you, my friend. Always will. Hug your mom and daddy, everybody. <laughs>